Hello everyone, welcome to the final round. We have our instant. We have creatures. We have two lads. Let's keep. Apparently we're dumb persons. Wait, dumb per- yeah. Oh yeah, so um, <laughs> our match versus random drooler, if you haven't seen it yet, it's very short, but <laughs> he spent nine minutes, nine and a half minutes waiting to arrive, and then we defeated the entire, we did the entire match <laughs> In three in minutes of his clock. And we're dumb. And we're dumb for winning. <laughs> uh, the salt is real. John just loves salt. Ooh. You, people, people should really just send you salt packets in the mail, John. <laughs> kind of like a glitter bomb sort of thing. Except they're just salt. I don't have to think about doing that. <laughs> You'll just be like, so what, if, <laughs> salt. what happens if we don't draw a land here? We play Leaf Gilder? Yeah. Probably maybe better. Maybe we just play Troll, though. I don't know. Troll's pretty dang good. But Leaf Gilder Troll's gets good. us the ability to play one of these guys next turn if we don't draw another land. What if Leaf Gilder dies, though, here? Well, then Troll's gonna probably die, too. Well, which one do we want to stick around, is the question. Uh, I'd rather have Troll stick around, so we want to play Leaf Gilder, then? Okay. Okay. Had to think on that one. I think Troll is better to have stick around. Oh, there's a renowned creature. That card's good. That's the one we wanted to see for ourselves. Um, I guess we play Castellian here. Yep. Yeah. Because it dodges the fiery impulse. So. Well, if he has something to get rid of it, though, this could be very problematic. If he swings, I'm going to block. Yeah, I mean, we have to. Right, so we'll bounce. Yeah. We'll let him use his pump spell to kill our guy. Sure. So his pump spell kills our guy, then we get to at least play another guy. Hmm. So, land? Aven. Aven might be the play here. It's well, or it could close. be knight and try to trade with this again. I like knight. If he has another pump spell, well, once or, again, um, what about troll and hold up might of the masses? Yeah, I think I think we want to play around the two damage spell if we can. So play Aven then. Either Aven or troll. I like troll. But not okay. But not um. Hold up. Yeah. It's two. Yeah. yeah. That way we have the. Tr pump spell via the leaf gilder so that way it's less likely to be detected although Stuck we didn't attack he, what we didn't attack so it's like true yeah you know. that thing's big sure do we swing with the troll here i think we do I think we swing with the troll. We have the pump spell to make it so that way it gets through something. So it'll kill this off. And then we can play Timber Pack Wolf. Hmm. I don't know. We don't really. It's not really good. Well, it just has the option of trading pump spell for a creature, basically. Yeah. Which is basically all we want with the pump spell, right? I guess. I think it's just play nine. Yeah, it's, it's not. To... It's not optimal, but our mana choice, our mana base right now is not really lending us to the optimal situation. You know. Mm -hmm. All right, I am fine with this. No. I'm fine with that. That's fine, because I get to kill that guy. For each creature you control, okay. So, yeah, I, I know what I'm doing. I thought it might be each other creature. No, I know what I'm doing. That's why it's playable with when you only have one creature. It's just not great when mm -hmm. you only have one creature. That's big. Mm. Well, we might just be sitting back with regen, doing regens. I think that's what we're going to have to do, is just sit back and regen when he swings. Taking five is fine. I think we just play an even here, or... A 3 2. Hmm. One of them. 3 2 is okay. Um, I like the Aven if we're gonna play a guy. 
Because we can always then go like Sigil, Valor, Equip, Aven, and smack for like four in the air and get mm -hmm. an actual clock going. Sure. Yeah, taking five a couple of times is terrible. Yeah, I mean, ideally we just draw a land or two and then we come back completely. So, if we draw one land, we get to play Empath, which should hopefully find us another land. Yeah, and We don't chance. get to draw the land unless it's land creature, at which point then we get to draw and have a land on top. Yeah. That'd be good, land creature. So we'll just take five to the face. Yep, a lot of X. He's flooding a little bit too. He's flooding a bit, and we're just so starved it's not even funny, but this is... Oh god. That's mm -hmm. big. <laughs> That's big. <laughs> Well, at least it doesn't have trample, huh? It doesn't have trample, and it only has four toughness, no matter what. Straw land. <clears throat> hmm. Well, so here's my thought. We swing with this, get this to have renowned, then we play a knight, and we double block this thing. Trading Sounds knight, good. knight and wolf for that thing. Because just having him have a 7-4 sticking around and is not something I want. Not ideal. Although I suppose there's also the option to just block a regen. Yeah, we could double block and just regen. Yeah, I actually like that better, I think. The knight isn't doing much. Yeah, and that way we only lose one creature instead of two. And that also this way, if he tr tries to kill the troll here, we can just still double block the 7-4 if we need to. Right. Although it's not great. Because we need the mana. So we go block, block. Kind of surprised he didn't attack with the 1 3 also. Not really a reason. Alright, well, I will reach in that thing. That, uh. Alright, so he traded Might of the Masses for our Timber Pack Wolf, basically. Mm hmm. Which is still good for him. Yeah, and that's his last card. All right. So he Why not attack with to... one three? Um, I don't know. Hmm. Guess I play cleric and gain some life. Sure. <laughs> this is slightly ridiculous at this point. Yeah, I mean, well, we're making do with what we have. We have pass. of these cards, ten are non lands, fifteen are lands. So, yeah, pass. Um, I don't know what to say. I guess we double block this thing again. Probably go like throw block it. that, double block that, throwing away the troll. We could throw triple blocks on the Vastwood Gorger. So, 5 6. I think I'd rather just double block this guy, kill it off. Maybe just, I mean, we lose the troll, but at this point, the troll is sure. not getting through, ever. So. That way, we at least get one of his threats completely out, out of the way. Hey, a land. Alright. Now we can actually at least have chump blockers. Because these guys will just be chump blockers. Bottom one, top the other, so we draw it. I guess. Might as well. I can't even tell what I'm looking at because oh. it's so far back. Double Yeva's Force Mage. Oh. Um, so I bottomed one top to the other, and so we drew a Yeva's sure. Force Mage. Oh boy. Um, well, <clears throat> this is not great. <laughs> I guess he swings with everything. Uh, if he swings with everything, we get to... Uh, yeah. We'll block the Rune Servitor, and we'll chump here, and so we'll each draw a card, and we'll... He's going to get a Renowned trigger. You're chumping? Do you want to go to two? Yeah. He probably has the Searing Blaze. Well, if he has that, we lose Although it actually it doesn't have, um... Or, yes, it does. It does have the thing. Yeah, we just throw it uh, in front of the 1-3. If he has Searing Blaze, we lose. Yeah. yeah. But if he doesn't have it, maybe we come back from this somehow. 
by actually just playing 6-6 six, six next turn. Maybe. Hey, we actually get to play a 6-6. Six, six. Alright, well... <laughs> played your outs, I suppose, right? Yeah. Uh, I'll leave everything back for now. Yeah. Hopefully this works. I guess I just play another empath here. Or do I yeah, play the empaths are first. Either of those. Um, I kind of like the empath. I think empaths just to get a land on top, huh? Yeah, I think that's why I like the empath. It just it's a it's a chump blocker. Pretty much. That also potentially draws us a card, and okay, so we're just gonna reveal a land. I'll put. I'll That's bottom fine. the forest. Leave the planes on top, because that gets sure, us yeah. towards Kithian's irregulars doing better. Yeah. So we're just gonna sit on defense right now. Um, the only thing that can just straight kill us is the searing blaze effect. Otherwise, we just keep a bat a board stall of, of all hell going on here. Yeah, we gotta kill him before he draws uh, three damage, lightning javelin. Sure. So his so we have to kill him before he has lightning javelin or the other thing. So maybe since it's now four to four or five to four creatures, we can go sigil valor equip to this and then play mm. Yeva's force mage. So this guy will basically swap positions with a Yeva's force mage for who's for an untapped creature, and we can get in for a whole bunch of damage. Start getting an actual clock on him in the air. Hmm. Sigil costs one to equip. Yeah. Well, maybe we just go like Knight Yeva's Force Mage, speed it for. I think so. Here. Just keep yeah. flooding the board, basically. And then after that, we can drop the Sigil. Because actually now we, um, if we draw a land, we get to go like, Kithian's a regular Sigil and equip Sigil and smash. Because mm -hmm. Sigil's going to be for a whole crap ton of damage here. Yeah. Dragon Fodder. Okay. Okay. And a land. So a lot of cards like to kill us. Right? <laughs> we're, we're, we're just, we're dead to anything. So just play. <laughs> Alright. So we get to go Irregulars. And equip uh, sigil. So we'll go irregulars, sigil, suit smack sigil, for suit a sigil, lot. Swing for um for what? nine. Yeah. <laughs> plus seven, plus seven in the air. And if he plays a flyer, we can actually tap it. Yep. All right. No lightning oh, javelin. Vortex, no! If he has a land, we're dead! <laughs> no! No! I mean, I just... <laughs> no! <laughs> so Come close. on. Just... So close! <laughs> I'm not sure what else we could have done that game. We couldn't have done anything. I mean, we could have chumped <laughs> the turn I said chump there and let him draw the extra card earlier. Yeah, but then he would have had a 3 5 and we would have had nothing. Yeah. And we'd have one less guy. Damn it. We would have lost a lot earlier if we chomped. Yeah, I know, but still. Damn it. <laughs> <laughs> so, how good is Molten Vortex? Annoyingly good. Is it good enough to bring in Caterpillar, or do we just say. I think we could. Bring, I think we actually could bring in the Caterpillar, because Molten Vortex can shock creatures, too. It's true. I think I actually don't mind the caterpillar. It's just a cheap little thing to also chump block at some point. Um, we probably actually don't need the re recluse version because his colors don't have flying. Yeah. Okay. Just swap creature for a creature that could, you know, potentially have some utility. We have three lands, dear God. <laughs> we'll keep. <laughs> and evolving worlds. Wow. We have evolving wilds in this deck. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I'd forgotten that. Hmm. All right. 
Um, I guess Evolving Wilds will fetch up... Planes. Planes, yeah, because we only have double white, so... Yeah. Timber Pack Wolf! Go! <laughs> oh, there's our double green card. Yeah, oh uh, yeah, we have one <laughs> double green card in the entire deck. And we have Hopefully he just dies before this. So, I think we're going to have, like, a perfect curve here. Yeah. Because if we hit another land in the next turn or two, we get to go curving this into this, into Charging Griffin, into Outland Colossus, mm -hmm. into Kill Your Face. That's the dream. That is the dream. Let's make it a reality. <laughs> Moto, making dreams realities. Since 2001? I don't know. What is that? that? It's Chandra? Chandra. What does Chandra do? Uh, she pings us, and if she does three damage to us, she becomes a walker with plus two to shock us, minus two to shock something else, and minus seven to six damage us, and then we take three extra damage every turn. Ew. Yeah. So, let's say he has a kill spell. Um, he pings us, kills our guy, shoots... So we actually have to hold back here, I we think? We have to hold two guys back. So what we're going to do, I think, is actually swing with one and then play Charging Griffin. Yeah. If he has two kill spells, we lose, but... If he has two kill spells, then he has an active Chandra, which doesn't mean we lose, but it's not... Well, he kills us. all our guys. Yeah, I mean, it's not great for us, but we don't auto-lose. Pretty much auto-lose. Because he kills both our guys and uses Chandra to kill our third guy. Now, he could just play two red spells here and flip Chandra, too. Sure. Or just a lightning javelin, to So he's killing that one guy, and then he's going to... Ping us. Ping us the second time, I guess? Sure. Sure. So that's fine. Could have been a lot worse. Could have been a lot worse. So ideal draw is land? Huh? Oh. Hmm. <laughs> We're still in upkeep. <laughs> and we get through Kithians or Regulars, which is still very good. That's a solid card. Um, I think I swing with just the one wolf again. Probably, yeah. Just keep knocking some of his life total apart. So now we get to play Kithians or Regulars, which it should be very good here, because it doesn't die to Fiery Impulse since he doesn't have Spell Mastery. Yeah, he already got... It dies to another Lightning Javelin, lightning javelin but... Which... If he has might... Lightning Javelin, we're not getting hit, at least. Chandra. Prickle. What is this? Oh, sure. Yeah, that's fine. I got no problems with the Prickle Boy. Might of the Masses. Wow, Might is insane, right? So I think we actually get to swing with two guys here, and then drop Brawler's Plate post-combat, and have Might up. We could swing with... We can swing with Irregulars and a guy... Or, or we could just swing with Irregulars, and have Might to blow out a creature. Mm -hmm. And then still play Brawler Plate. I think but I tapping is really good, too. So, I mean, swing with the regulars, but what about just hold up tap? Um, we could instead of Brawler's Plate. Sure, I'm fine with that. Seems pretty strong. I don't think Brawler's Plate... I mean, we're probably going to be using the Might of Masses to make certain that we just kill the Prickle Boar. So yeah. That's pretty much an assumed fact here, I think. Well, we could swing with uh, Force Mage and that thing. Because yeah. if he has a kill spell, um... Then Chandra will flip. Well, no, then we can tap Not it. necessarily we tap it, yeah. Uh, but if he has an instant speed kill spell, he gets to flip it. In. Or, because he gets to untap it. Or, no, mm. he gets to untap Chandra if he has a kill spell. If he has an instant speed yeah. kill spell. Okay, I think I so, like swinging with two. That's fine. Yeah, this, this is okay. It's a little more risky, but I think the payoff is higher because... This is like an extra turn off the Double clock. Double blocking there. Uh, so that's actually fine. We're going to lose the irregulars, but we're going to kill both his guys. 
Yeah, it's a two for two. And we get to drop Brawler's Plate now, too. Yeah. So he's like, ping you, and then we're like, okay, kill... Or actually, no. Kithian's Irregulars is a 7-6. He kills both oh, guys. Disgusting. <laughs> well, alright. That's <laughs> pretty good. Okay. Oh, that's you right. You are dumb. Um, well, interesting. Doesn't Renown put a trigger on the stack? I think so, why? Let's see, four... Okay, yeah, never mind. That, never mind, I get it now. Never mind. I was trying to figure out why my math felt off, but it was because I was counting as plus two, plus two, instead of plus three, plus three. Yeah, it's three. Counts. <laughs> well, that so. went pretty well. <laughs> <laughs> Poor Chandra, she just got, like, massacred there. Um, I think we just Squish. quit. We don't have any sideboard cards. Right? Mm. I don't think we want mental webs. Maybe? Probably not. No. Vine Snare is useless. Hitch Clever Close doesn't do much. Yeah, we'll just submit. Caterpillar seems pretty anemic. Yeah, but it does give us that random out, which is always nice. Yeah. And it just also gives us the option of going turn one, land one, one. And it has sigil value, too. This hand is interesting. Ooh, Rogue's Passage, that card exists? Yeah, things you forget that are in your deck. This hand is mulligan. though. I think we Oopsie, keep this. Mulligan. Yeah. It's definitely a, one of those trickier lands to consider. Um, well, there's the Vortex. Okay. I don't oh, think there's he's the Caterpillar! <laughs> <laughs> so, Nick is actually just... he spends a land... I think he's gonna discard a land to kill the Caterpillar. He might. Yeah. <laughs> Yay. Caterpillar just took a shock to the face. And then yeah, there's his Caterpillar. <laughs> it's a war of the Caterpillars. So he's on uh, two land. Yeah, Vortex on a mulligan is not very good. No, especially when you're shocking to kill a Caterpillar. Mm -hmm. Okay, he has a 3-2 that's got Menace, which is annoying, but not the end of the world. Ideal draw is just a planes for Stalwart, even. Yeah. Boom. Get there. <laughs> what happens when he swings with Caterpillar? Do we block? I think no, so. Because he discards what? a land to kill our Aven. Then he has no cards in hand. Yeah, but... No, yeah, plus he's not even swinging with that. He's swinging with the Menace. Okay. That's fine. So we'll swing with the Aven. Oh, and then we can play Sylvan Messenger? Or do we play Empath? Do we even want to swing? I think it's we unclear. Do. I think we want the renown trigger. We're getting I mean, beat down hard though. That's six. We're at sixteen. That's... We're gonna have body, so we get to block one of the two of these. Either way, we're playing a body. Yeah. So I think this is fine to swing because making this a two four is, is significantly better than having it as a one three. Is it? Yes, because then it can block more things and be more effective. Well, it's blocking pretty effectively now. I think we... Yeah, yeah. I mean... I think we want to swing with it. I don't think it's that straightforward. He only has one card, and we have six. So next turn he just gets in with the Menace guy instead. Well, if actually, we... what happens is next turn we play a guy, and then we double block the Menace guy and lose the 1-3. But let's say uh, we swing, we play a 2-2, two -two, he just vortexes it, we take 6, and then we have a 2-4, which and then is we just a 2-4. play four. another 2-2, two -two, and then have pump up. Okay. I think, I, I think it's actually a get in there moment. Okay, I mean, it's, it's very close. It's a very close situation, but I think it's a get in there moment. I suppose Messenger might be a little better than... Mm, yeah, because it has a chance of getting more guys. It has a chance of getting Gilder and... Or Gilder would just be very... send everything away. Sure. I have a feeling that he's just going to swing with these two, probably. 
Lightning Javelin on the Sylvan Messenger. That's fine. That really is. I mean, we're taking six, but that's fine. Because we go to ten. Six is a lot. Well, we go to ten. Oh, and Cleric of the Forward Order. See? No? Okay, Cleric is really good. So we get to play Rogue's Passage, we get to play Cleric, gain some... Probably just Empath, though. I think it's Cleric, because gaining the two life here, we can still now double block the Bogart, and if he he can't shoot... Even if he draws a land, he can't kill the Cleric, because we go Might of the Masses. I yeah, think but we could have went Might of the Masses with Empath. I know would use the mana a lot better. I, th I think it's still fine. I don't think we're in danger of dying. Ugh. Chandra's annoying, but he doesn't have any way to get Chandra through. Okay. So, now we'll go Empath. I guess I should leave up the white. The green for might. Well, no, I meant leave up green-white. Oh, yeah. Uh, bottom both. We don't need any more lands. We're pretty good on lands. Except for Kithian's right. Oh, and we draw a Timber Pack Wolf. Um, Perfect. I think we just play Timber Pack Wolf, right? Yep. Just keep the board stall going. Because we will win, I think, through a board stall in this board state. So. Because he can't yeah, get Vortex. in. He, he gets to ping us once a turn, and he has Vortex, which is kind of iffy for us, but it's not like the end of the world. Caterpillar is actually pretty good. We lost our Caterpillar already. <laughs> His Caterpillar. Oh. Yeah, it destroys Brawler's Plate. Um, I guess we play Charging Griffin and just start getting in in the air? Yeah, I think so. Or just a random 2-2. Two -two. Maybe we want the 2-4 to stay back. Okay, well, Cleric, go be a Cleric. Yeah. <laughs> Go smash the trades here. Over. Trading Good. with Rune Servitor? I think that's fine. We'll each draw a card. I mean, it's scarier because he's drawing potential shocks every time, but I mm -hmm. think this is fine. Trading? But that's fine for leaving back the too far then. <laughs> yeah. So, we'll just trade here. Especially if he does something like attack, and we block the too far and he tries to shoot Should it. we just play Undercity Troll here? No, I think we want to wait on the troll for next turn. I think we just want Might of the Masses here. As in... Uh, I mean, if we play troll, it's be it's more efficient on the mana, but then troll dies to him having a land. Which is... Okay, I think. I think it's... Yeah, right. if he uses a land on that, We do have to speed fine. up a bit. We're at 7 minutes and he has 18. So. Yeah, well, I think we're, we're going to kill him here. Right, I think we're still in very good shape. Um, we, we just have to play around the fact that he does have the ability to potentially just do us a bunch of damage out of nowhere. Sure. But right so now he's probably a... holding like four, he's probably holding some pretty high drop creatures. Yeah, so he's going to kill Troll. That's fine. That's fine. Poor Troll. We knew you not. I think I'd that. rather have, I'd rather have that die than like Charging Griffin. Right. Alright. Um, well I guess Charging Griffin gets in here then? Yeah, definitely. And then I guess down. I play Brawler's Play and just get it killed by the cost of Caterpillar. Sure. Now this will be interesting. He might discard a land to try to kill the Griffin here, at which point we might of the masses. Yeah, that's what it's looking yeah. like. Yeah. So then it's like, nope. I'll smack you for four more. This is gross. Now he might discard another land here. Okay, fine. That's perfectly fine by me. <laughs> we traded one card for his entire hand. Yeah. All right. We'll two cards. It was a two, two, two for two. Oh yeah, it was a two for two. That's fine. So Brawler's plate will get removed pretty reasonably here, but. All right. Now it's a lot closer. Right. This is interesting. Need to... oh, okay. Um. Hmm. I guess I equip Brawler's Plate, go to combat, let him kill it, then drop the Sigil. Yeah. 
Equip it to a, what, timber pack or yeah, something? Yeah, equip it to the timber pack, Wolf. So I guess we'll smack with the timber pack, Wolf. He'll probably block and then kill the thing? Yeah, he should. Block with Caterpillar. I think he's going to block with then Caterpillar it loses and then kill the uh, Brawler's Plate so it loses Trample. Which point Caterpillar's out of the way, so that's another creature removed from the field, and then we get to play our equipment that's actually going to break this game open. Hopefully. Ideally. I might as well equip it to something. Yeah. Like a flyer. Okay. <sighs> yep, Chandra's pinging us. We do have to be aware, Chandra is going to be a problem. Some yeah, it's pretty annoying. It's a good card. Okay, he's killing that off, so he's going to swing with the menace guy here. Get in, put us to six, because we can't block. We need to draw something that does something. That does something. <laughs> Given my options, that's a pretty good card. Yeah. We're not attacking mm. this turn, but... Yeah, we have to sit back. Because if he does have a land to throw away to the Timber Pack Wolf, then we have to... So we have to be aware, Chandra is going to kill us very soon here. Yup. We're essentially at, like, discard? two. He's discarded four, five... He's discarded five lands. So he's drawn nine lands, ten probably. He probably has another one in there, in his hand here. Alright, double block like this, because... yeah. Yep. Titanic growth. Would be annoying. Might of masses. Chandra Ping. Okay. Titan. Titan. Yeah, Titan Strength. Still kill it. Yeah, we still kill it. Chandra's but now we're basically three, so we're basically dead. Dead? <laughs> to land. We're dead to him having uh yeah, we're dead to land basically. Or any red spell or Alright, play this thing. Pump the regulars. Get in for some damage. Suit it up. Yeah, suit it Keeping up. Keeping up the whole bite. Yep. <sighs> pretty dead. We are pretty dang dead. But maybe he doesn't have a land. That's all we can hope or right now. Any we, red spell. Or a red spell. Or well it has to be land and red spell, I think. Yeah. Right. Gotta have something at some point. We're at three. <laughs> mm, don't have a way to kill us. Aw, damn it. <laughs> damn it. <laughs> I suppose we should have saved the caterpillar. That was the mistake. Yeah, that was our misplay. We rushed the caterpillar out there and got blown up. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> Well, oh well. You live and you learn. Yeah, molten you draw a lot of lands. Molten vortex is really good, especially mm. when you draw eleven lands like he did. Yeah. Um, it makes certain that you don't even care about you, the fact that you're flooding. So, anyways, um, that was our first recorded Origins draft. Hopefully, you all enjoyed it. Um, please feel free to like, comment, subscribe, share the channel. We enjoy the press, and we'll look forward to seeing you all in the next video. Have a good night.